irritable about it. But let, so, yeah, let's dig in deeper then. Yeah. yeah. So <sighs> I don't like saying this stuff because it seems spiteful. And I think that's my challenge that that idea always gets in my head what, as to why I don't communicate correctly the first time. <laughs> So, Let it all out. It's so cool. It's for cool. example, for example, I will do things because my uh, my love language to show love is acts of service. Number one, acts of service. You just do shit for you. So when I do stuff like clean up the garage or do all the things, and I think about how you're gonna, you know, like even your tools, organizing your tools. Like, I'm like, oh, my God, I know he's going to maybe give me, like, why did you take out my tools from my case and why did you throw it away? I'll be like, well, if I don't, I have to learn how to explain it, then he'll won't say anything. So I just <laughs> take out all the tools and I organize it. I label it. And I just think about all these little things to to make sure that you, you see what I'm saying, that it is better for you. Yeah, I, know you, I know you're going to give me pushback. No, Why do you throw it away? What is this? What is this here for? <laughs> and it's always in a tone like that. And I'm like, <laughs> so I always have to prepare myself to, to pitch you, to sell you on, on why this is a better idea. So I do stuff like that, right? Cool. And then when we go to do the gym. Was it the squat rack? Mm, the squat rack. But then my... Uh, my little punching bag thing, the thing. So I've been wanting to get this shit for a year now. And then I, I do all that stuff. But then when I want to set up my thing, the, the one thing in there, it's still up to me to do it. Like I still need help with it. I still need to set it up and all this stuff. Like where am I going to set it up? And it always feels like the priority goes to your things versus mine. So I don't want to be spiteful or be like tit for tat or keep score or you got this. So I get this. I don't want that. I just want to maybe wake up one day too and be like, oh, cool. You set up my punching bag. (laughs) (laughs) That's what I would like. Oh, cool. Like you made space for me in your gym. You know what I'm saying? Even though you're like, you're like, oh, yeah, you maybe you can have it over there. Like you did always talk about it the night we were setting up everything late and you were hungry and all that stuff. You're like, oh, maybe you can have your thing over here. But but that was it. Whereas I feel like I'm taking. See, I don't want to say it like, oh, I'm doing more. That's not what I'm trying to say. I just want I just want it to be included in your mind when you're thinking about the gym versus it's like. Oh, look what I got for me. Look what I got for me. Oh, look what I got on Amazon for me. Oh, I see. I see. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And that's that's the way that you handle a lot of new shiny things. Yeah, that's crazy, huh? Uh, new, to think about like Yeah, it's like so exciting that you uh I think for myself to be like then I'm like stuck in that tunnel vision again. Yes. And I'm just thinking about that new item. Yeah. Yes, I know. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> so that's yeah. why I get turned off sometimes because even though I know you want me to go, ooh, good job, be cool, that's a great thing, and I do that for you. But then it turns into like 24-7 of that, and then I start to shut off. I'm like, I don't want to hear about it anymore. And I'm already mad because I didn't tell you like, okay, because I'm not, I don't have a natural nurturing tone or soul <laughs> where I'm like, okay, like, we talked about your gym for a very long time, okay? Uh, so maybe you can make some room in your brain for what, what I'm doing over here. I don't have that yet. I would like to. And maybe me saying that right here on the podcast is going to make me a lot better about doing that. Uh, uh, uh. But um, And that's my hope. But I just naturally don't incline that way. I'm just like, shut the fuck up. I don't want to hear about your gym anymore. That's how I feel in my brain, uh-huh. right? So... I that's that's all I have to say about that. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, when you say it straight up, I do stop. I know. And sometimes I don't. Sometimes you don't. You keep going. And yeah. I'm just like, I try to be as. But then I try to hold it. In. Yeah, I know. And it's just like bursting out of you. I'm and then, like, I, then I, I guess I'll just go towards my 
office here. <laughs> and then you go away, and then you go look up more yeah. stuff for your gym. It's I'm crazy. like, all right, didn't get it. But I don't want to be so direct all the time. Like I said before in the car, right? Hmm. If I, if you're like, oh, just tell me. Just tell me, right? I'm like, yeah, I could just tell you. But at the same time, what I said in the car before, when we were heading to the freaking Filipino store, I was like, dude, if I just tell you all the time, I feel like your mom. And I feel like you're not taking responsibility for your words, your actions, how you feel. So now it's up to me to not only manage my own emotion and my own perception of how I'm receiving you, but to manage you. And that in turn feels like the business again, where it's like, well, yeah. you didn't want to lead. And I'm like, oh, why? <laughs> that's not who I, you know, want to be with. That's not, that's not why I'm attracted to you or with you is because you don't want to do the things that you said you're going to do. Mm-hmm. Right. Same thing with me. I don't, I don't want to um, ever go back to being really quiet and non-communicative like before when you you were like oh we can talk about it i'm like oh really (laughs) long time ago right yeah i would just like bottle up and not tell you why i'm angry and uh, you're like oh we could actually talk about it like you were very calm and very patient and forgiving i was like oh i didn't know that (laughs) so i don't want to ever go back to that Mm-hmm. So in the same way, like, I don't, I don't want you, I always want you to better yourself for you. And that's, that's who I love. That's who I want to um, support. But it gets very frustrating. I know that's not going to be all the time because you can't always just be, oh, I'm going to be the leader all the time. I know it's very human to get tired. And, but I'm just saying, like, <laughs> that was just my response. It's just like, that's why I get turned off or I get frustrated with with the behavior not with you just with the behavior Mm -hmm. so like it's just for me and my responsibility in this marriage and as we're going into our third year and you even mentioned bringing out our vow our vow books we um, bring it out every year yeah which i I was like oh thank you it's like a vow renewal (laughs) yeah thank you yeah (laughs) Thank, thank you for uh bringing that up because even my mentor told me this too. He's like, this is, you know, this is what you said yes to. <laughs> and I was so frustrated. And he was like, this is what you said yes to. You can't back out of this. <laughs> I was like, hmm. you know, he's telling me all the things I don't want to hear, but I need to hear. And he's like, you, this is what you said yes to. Easy. I was like, yeah, it is easy. So as we go into our third year, like I want to be better at that in this coming year where or from now on from right now not just because it's in a book but because i i notice it in myself which is to be um not just not to think of uh just me too in those times when we have a fight then i then i think of just me when all the times before we have a fight i'm like we us our but then when you have a fight i'm like I'm fucking out of here. I'm like, I turn, I turn the switch and I don't want to think like that. After, if we have a fight, I want to be like, okay, we're having a fight. Hmm. How do we come through it? Or how do we be better? That's how I want to be. Instead of my natural reaction is to be like, I'm out of here. Or I want to escape. Or like I, start, I started thinking about I, 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 which uh, Jeff no, no, noted in me in my language. And I was like, oh, damn. 